So what is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back again to Tech Kiran YouTube channel Shape Shift OS the latest version based on Android 12 first look is here and we have installed unofficial version on Redmi Note 10 Pro it's available for Redmi Note 10 Pro and Pro Max users and if you are user of any other device the things might be available for your device too maybe very soon but right now this is the Shape Shift OS version 3.0 which we installed re uniqueless version with the latest september sorry the latest november security patch for you everything else is same as this is shape shift os so it was expected that you will get the pixel launcher pre installed it is included the ui sector same this is the default wallpaper which you will get let me show the default launcher once that is this is a pixel launcher it was expected also the shape shift os version based on android version 11 was quite good with all the pixel goodies and everything what you need and same here with the android version 12 there are no customizations yet right now but yes we may get the customizations very soon right now no major options no major features are included for example you can see the quick settings panel is basically looking like same you don't have the separate tile for mobile data and wifi let me show you once here as you can see there is no extra tile for wifi and mobile data or basically no separate tile for you but things are quite same there are no major differences almost same like all the android 12 base rooms i think so but it's just all about you let me show you one two more things here you cannot reset these tiles you only can reset these tiles you cannot resize the tiles etc wifi hotspot both were working at a same time in this build is i'm just talking about the device specific things right now as you can see wifi and hotspot both of these things are working at same time screen recording i got some issues here in screen recording it was a little bit laggy if i enable this screen recording and try to record screen it was quite laggy and as i previously mentioned you it's about just the device specific things it's not about the official version because official version will have other things that also depends on which device you are using and redmi note 10 pro you have this issue what i faced i'm not sure about other things but this was the issue which i faced but of course this is not a major thing in the terms of camera section you can see i haven't even opened camera because i just don't like this i just don't use this snap camera on my device at any cause even on my any device i don't use this camera app you have the option to use the g cam you have the option to use some other camera options google camera go edition whatever you want to use unfortunately anx camera is still not compatible with android 12 But yes, we might get the support for that too very soon. But right now, it's not there. You need to keep this thing in your mind. Also, if you are a user of Redmi Note 10 Pro, if you still want to use the Shape Shift OS uh, based on Android 12 on your device, make sure to check out the Safety Net status. It's passing. I haven't rooted my device yet. By the way, if you want to install Magis, you can enable Magis Guide, which is almost dead. But yes, you can still give it a try. I recommend you not to root your device. And yes, if you use custom rooms, you need to keep this thing in mind that Magis Guide is gonna die very soon. So yes, you will not be able to pass the Safety Net status. or you'll not be able to use the banking apps on your device i think so but let's see about the future we'll talk about that later on in the terms of options features customizations whatever you want to check out you can see features are kind of same there are no major changes you can see everything is same wallpapers and styles which of course includes the monet theming which was expected which was needed it's there you can simply enable the themed icons options if you want to this is a default wallpaper by the way this pink kind of color for you and you can see there's no pixel mode launcher it's pixel launcher of course but this is not a mode launcher with more themed icons or more app grid options for you almost same kind of things are available here in system as extra gestures live translate option is also there everything else is same gestures you can simply use a one handed mode if we want to and other includes the device specific things where we have the refresh rate related settings if you want to install this link is in the description this is all about the first impressions of shape shift os android version 12 i'll see you in the next video goodbye Like I'm floating through the air